Sauro Poseidon was one of the biggest sauropods to have ever existed. It walked in North America and was found in Oklahoma, in the Antlers Formation. This herbivore has incomplete remains but paleontologists estimate it to be 28 to 34 meters long or 91.8 to 111.5 feet long. Its remains have been dated to the early Cretaceous. The first sauropocytin bones were discovered in 1994 by a team led by Dr. Richard Cefeli, but they misidentified them as petrified tree trunks. In 1999, he passed the remains on to Matt Weddle, who discovered they weren't tree trunks at all, but gigantic sauropod vertebrae. This made headlines that same year, and the next year, they were named Sorrow Poseidon. This sparked a media sensation as people believed it was the biggest dinosaur yet. Paleontologists used giraffe the titan due to it having some of the most complete remains to estimate the complete size of Sorrow Poseidon. This allowed Sorrow Poseidon to be the tallest dinosaur if accurate, able to lift its head 17 meters or 55.7 feet above the ground. However, Sauro Poseidon's overall design was more lightweight. This means it most likely wasn't that big. When mature, Sauro Poseidon was basically attack proof from any other predators that lived with it in North America at that time, such as Acrocanthosaurus. This was due to its size. And finally, its name is a reference to the Greek god Poseidon. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to the channel and give this video a like, and as always, I'll see you in the next one.